Let's make appetizer. The Asian wonton prawn cups. But before that, watch this. Our ingredients is all in your front. First, let's marinate prawn with salt, ground black pepper, and paprika. Make sure that you coat the prawn, that you coat all the prawn with the paprika. Mix them all together and set aside for 5 minutes or longer time. Next step, let's make our guacamole. Cut the avocado in half, twist it, and take out the seeds from it. Using a spoon, scrape the avocado flesh from the skin and put it on a bowl. Then, add the chopped green chili, the chopped parsley, and the white onion. You can use red onion here if you want a stronger taste. Then, add one and a half teaspoon of lemon juice. Add the ground black pepper and salt. Using the fork or if you have a smasher, it's better. Smash them all together until the avocado become a fine paste. After mashing it properly, taste it if the salt and pepper or lemon juice is enough. If not enough, add more. That's what I do. Then mix them all properly again. After mixing it, cover it with cling wrap and make sure that there's no air on it. Press the cling wrap down until you reach the guacamole so no air can stay in there. So our guacamole will not be darkened. Then leave it in the fridge while we are frying our prawn and preparing our wonton cups. Heat up a frying pan and add oil on it. Then, fry the prawn until all well done. About 2 minutes each side.
After frying, dish out and set aside. Add some oil in a small cupcake molder or a small pie crust molder. If you have a cooking spray, it's better, but I don't have cooking spray right now, so I use oil on it. Then I use a brush to evenly spread the oil on it. Then, take one wonton skin, put it on the molder, press it down until you mold it as a cup. Make sure you press it carefully because the wonton skin is very thin. So there, after molding the wonton skin on the cupcake molder, let's add it in a baking tray. I'm only making seven, so I'll just use seven wonton cups and seven cupcake molder. And then bake it in the oven for about 5 to 8 minutes at 180 degrees celsius or until the wonton skin is very crispy after 8 minutes of baking this is our wonton cups now it's ready to fill up with our filling and our pot still hot so be careful on it let's remove it in the pan and put it on a serving plate. So this is our wonton cups now. Let's fill it up with our toppings. First, add the guacamole. Scoop a small amount of it and add in every cup. As you can see, our guacamole didn't become brown or didn't darken. That is the one trick that I learned when making guacamole. After the guacamole, let's add the chopped tomato in it. Then add the pond on the top of every cup, of every wonton cup. We 
You can position the prawn like this or you can make it stand. It depends on how you like it. But I like it when it stands so I will make it all stand. So there you go, our Asian prawn wonton cups is ready to serve. This is our Asian prawn wonton cups. Serve it immediately while the wonton cups still crispy. Bon appetit! I hope you like our appetizer recipe for this day. The Asian Prawn Wonton Cups. Thank you for watching and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please press the subscribe button and press the notification bell so you will be updated for my latest videos. And please like and comment below if you have any suggestions or any questions about our recipe. See you in my next video. Bye!